so I see a lot of people doing all these movie reviews and they keep getting docked because they keep showing the videos and clips and images from the movies or the big music from the movie or other crap and they keep getting docked and their stuff taken down. So I've never really done one before. Just got through watching Renfield. Pretty, pretty good fucking movie, actually. Um, Nicolas Cage really, really goes and um, basically just takes the Bela Lugosi Dracula from the original movie and continues that character, but with more teeth. And uh, Renfield is supposed to be the Renfield from the original movie. So, you know, they've been running around for a few hundred years, or about a hundred years together. And uh, it's actually pretty good. Aquafina, the wannabe comedian, whatever the hell she's supposed to be, isn't her comedic self. She's actually pretty serious playing a cop in the middle of this bloodbath of everything. I mean, it's, it's bloody. A lot of blood. Oh my god, there's so much blood. And he, Dracula doesn't make other vampires. He just makes more Renfields. So people don't become vampires. They just get part of his power. So there's not a lot, of, no other vampires running around, just more Renfields. So... But overall, pretty good. Um, universal, so it's definitely a monster movie. It's not... It's got some funny moments, but it's not... Uh, it's not for little kids at all. <laughs> um, unless you really want your kid to watch Dracula eating people and, and seeing faces ripped off and impaling arms and Literally, he takes arms and impales people to a door. Yeah. After ripping the arms off somebody else. <clears throat> Overall, pretty good. Um, if you like vampire movies and Dracula and, and you're a fan of Nicolas Cage, he's not pretty. He's not really himself. He actually did do a pretty decent job of trying to continue the Bela Lugosi of Dracula. So, not too bad. Not too bad at all. So, definitely recommend seeing it if you want to go see it. If you don't want to see it, well, you know, I don't know if they're going to try to continue this storyline anymore. Or, I mean, it'd be cool if they bring in, if Nick, Nick Cage is the, the focal Dracula. If he comes back, I don't know. So they, uh, I mean, this this could be the start of the, the monster movies from Universal. I know they screwed it up with uh, bringing that idiot fucking Tom Cruise. I mean, seriously, you're going to bring in somebody who is the power base that he is to build your freaking monster stories? No. I mean, Nick Cage, he's pretty big, but he he could be the, the focal character if they want to continue it. But, I don't know. So much stuff gets screwed up in the, in the uh, studios because, you know, these idiots running stuff. They can't seem to get their shit together when they're trying to make something. So, they, we may never get the, the big stories anymore. We never we never get to see all these cool characters on screen again. I mean, the last time I think the monsters were all together on a movie screen was, uh, oh, what the hell was that, that movie where the kids were fighting them? Um, monsters, Inc.? No, no, it was something else. Um, I've got the movie at home, I don't remember what it's called. But, uh, they, uh, I think that was the last time we saw the monsters on screen together. DC's coming up with something soon with the monsters for the DC Universe, Marvel, 
might be working on theirs for their universe. They both have access in their comics for both of them. I don't know how it's all going to go. But go see Renfield. Definitely something to watch. Um, yesterday I watched Super Mario World. And definitely a good movie. So a lot of good movies this week. Um, next week I got to see what's coming out. I think there's something else coming out tomorrow. I'm going to go catch it next week. And my day's off. So pretty much my first movie thing. And first time fully seeing me on, on video. So sitting here in the theater parking lot. Getting ready to go home. Got to go to work. It's almost nine. So it wasn't. It was an hour and 40 minutes with the uh, previews. So maybe an hour and a half. Not too long. So pretty good pace. The uh, I mean it's it's a Dracula movie, so there's gonna be some unbelievable crap in it, but overall pretty good. So go see it. That's my recommendation. I'm gonna go home and try and get some rest and try and make it home without getting hit by these idiots out here. I don't know what they're doing in the parking lot. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> People are stupid. And maybe the snow finally stopped. It's been snowing the last three days. Yay. Well, I'm going to go home. Y'all go see the movie. I enjoyed it. I think you will too.